If most of your teachers were white women, you're not alone. Yeah, that is slowly changing. At East Magnet High School, for example, some of the black men on the staff are teaching black boys. They're role models and they're proof to these boys that education can be a career path for them as well. News Channel 5's Hannah McDonald has the story. All right, where are you going? This way, this way. In high school. I know, let's go, keep going, keep going, keep going. Students often need a little motivation. Let's go, let's go guys. Motivating kids. All right, so welcome back again. Drive science teacher and wrestling coach, Raymond Bass. I enjoy what I do. I get up every day. I come in here, I smile, I say good morning to y'all, even when y'all don't say good morning to me. I love what I do. Bass's job is what brings this group of black male students to his classroom. Because there is a huge shortage. With the help of TSU, East Magnet High School has been educating these students on careers in education for the last month. If I can get one or two to become teachers, well-qualified teachers, then that's a success for me. Only 2% of all teachers in the U.S. are black men. Have y'all had a black male teacher that's been impactful in your lifetime? Coach Baz. Coach Baz, all right, Coach Baz right there. Yeah. To move the needle, these men are talking to the boys about ACT scores, dual enrollment, and background checks, things to consider if they choose to follow in their footsteps. Like Coach Baz said, we learn better when we being taught by somebody that looks like us, so I would say that for sure. The mentors hope what they say sticks. So, is to be the head coach, you have to be a certified teacher. And it motivates them to teach too. So, came and I count on you. When, when you get done, you're going to come back, be my assistant coach, and then take over as the head coach. You got me on that, bro? All right. In East Asheville, Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5.